What's going on, guys? It is Donodox here, and welcome back to Outer Worlds. This is amazing. I'm really enjoying this series. I hope you guys are as well. We're going out into Phineas's lab, and you know, this time, I think we're going to take Felix. Uh, we're going to take Felix and Pavate this time, because we need to get Felix and Lenny leveling up, don't we? We can also give him some proper weapons as well to work with. It would be nice to use all three companions, that I could carry more stuff. But that's all well and good. Now this place should be kind of friendly. Yeah, he really is loud. Right, so we're here. Uh, I'm assuming that I'm be able to take stuff. No, everything's empty. Of course, Phineas. Phineas. Oh, that's how you melee. All right, that's something to know. Notes for. Oh, there's a quick way of switching weapons. Press, press this, and then you can choose what weapon to switch to. Right, I'm that's securing my ongoing experiments. And securing myself. The hell for this? I wonder if it's round here. Okay, let's keep going. Yeah, I absolutely wiped everyone out on Groundbreaker. Yeah, this is a very strange place, Phineas. Yeah, just talk to the pig. I'm sure that'll work out. Might I say, I'm not one for chatting. I'm more here for your stuff. Your gimmicks, if they were. What in the earth is this pig? All right, Phineas. Science uh -huh. weapon. I see you found my portable molecular compression device, better known as a shrink ray. Find a target, point, shoot. Your target will shrink down into a manageable size, whereupon you may commence beating them to a pulp. Feel free to try it on a marauder sometime. Yeah, sure, I'm sure I'll do that, Phineas. I want to know if you can kill Phineas. <laughs> so this is where it all began. This is where I was, wasn't it? <laughs> Quite a cool looking place, but... How do I get inside the room? Oh, thank the law. Your skin hasn't spontaneously changed colour. Potential so welcome. Make yourself at home. My secret hideout is your secret hideout. Oh, okay. You could have asked me before shoving me into an escape pod. Any chance you could repair that motoring device? The one I gave you before your pod landed? Ruined beyond repair. Impossible to find replacement parts. That's Halcyon manufacturing for you. Don't worry about it. I'm reasonably certain you're not going to spontaneously expire. No need to monitor your recovery. All right. Mm. That reminds me. I appreciate you putting up. I'll just take a look Great. around then. By all means. Can I get inside? I want to kill Phineas. <laughs> I see why they barred it. There's no way. If I could kill Phineas, that'd be so dumb. Terminal. Right, anyway, this was pointless. Well, not pointless, but it's kind of a big lab. Don't you agree? Like, did you need this much space? How is it so hidden? Oh, well, doesn't really matter. Not that I missed you. I assure you, I am not capable of such emotional capacity. I don't really care. We need to go to Groundbreaker. The Groundbreaker has approved our request for docking, Captain. You're free to disembark. Of 
Acquire a science weapon on Rampage. The logs of Halfon Terminal mentioned rumors from of the scientists who bragged about his power. It's not really giving me a place to go here. I've got to sort of just find it. Now, obviously, there'll be no one here because I literally killed everyone uh, in the first section. The second section, however, still has people in it. I just, yeah, decided to be a funny idea just to wipe out everyone, take their flamethrower. There's still a couple of people alive. You got him. Look at the madness that happened here. It certainly wasn't me. <laughs> Bang. Mm, do we hack into there? We're not the best of ideas. Oh, we got a cloak now for stealth. And I gotta try and find this myself. I don't have a guide anymore. The log of Harfon's terminal mentioned rumors from the ground pick of a scientist who bragged about a powerful weapon he was researching. Perhaps more detail can be found on the station. Another Harfon leg mentioned shop in Gladys shop for old records. All oh, right, Gladys shop. Oh shit! Right, everyone hates me. Right, okay, it's obvious what's happening here. Like I said, I've got a flamethrower. Like, right. we've been through this before. I'm obviously not welcome on the groundbreaker anymore. Where are you? Flamethrower! I said! No! I told you. Things will not go well for you. I have a flamethrower! Do people not understand what flamethrowers do? But yeah, we're killing absolutely everyone, it looks like now. It's got to that stage where we have to kill everyone. Yeah, I'm not going to mention it. I'm going to get some pretty good shit from all this. But I, I do appear to have um, killed too many people in the Groundbreaker. That it's alerted everyone. Um, but yeah, I decided to uh, do this and there's no going back. The choices in these conflicts. Let's kill the drone. Ah, Gladius. Here's what I'm looking for. We interrupt your regularly scheduled advertisement for the following season. <laughs> I was like dead scared of me. Oh! Wow. Alright, Gladys, oh, off no. it. I think I spoiled myself! Uh, there's no guards anymore! Gladys office said there was in here, did it? Is it the safe, by any chance? I bet it's the safe. No, it isn't. Right, what else were the rumours? Another half on log mentioned looking in the Gladys shop for old records. Apparently, the smuggler acquired several leads that Gladys on the ground picker is dead, unable to sell you anything that might lead to science weapon. Ah, so me killing Gladys, uh, Gladys means it's going to be a bit more tricky. Right, so. Another half on log mentioned looking in Gladys shop for old records. Apparently, the smuggler acquired several leads that way. Gladys on Groundbreaker is dead and unable to tell you anything that might lead. Right, so we've got to acquire the science weapon. Well, if it's not round here, then I'm going to have to search the entire Groundbreaker until I find it, it seems to me. That seems to be the case. I think it'd be in the safe, you know, to be honest, but never mind. Are there any old records? Did I pick up the old records? Right, so not in Gladys' office. So let's try the station. We didn't actually look around the station. Oh, you know the restricted area. Right, remember, we're still, we are still not friendly around here. So I'm having the flamethrower on. 
That's not the flamethrower. What you're doing. The thing I'm doing is I'm going to attack. Make him regret it. See, it doesn't really matter. I have a flamethrower, so no one can touch me. I have this armor, so no one can touch me at all. Hey, I don't need to kill anyone. Lol, look at them. Look at them. They're all scattering. Oh. Oh. Who's shooting in there? This is too easy. Thank you. I'll take all your alcohol. I love that, like, Pavati, if not, like, real life. Look at them all. They're so shit in it. <laughs> Lol. Ah, don't worry, man. It's all right. So, it's all good. Yeah. Right, these guys don't want anything. Oh, he's only dead. Hang on a second. <gasps> Go key card! I just got one for one of the safes! <laughs> uh hello to my little friend. Oh, your guys are drinking again. That's fine. Not a problem. Don't worry about me. We're just killing all the guards. Right, I really could do with some plasma ammo, if you get what I mean. So we're running out of flamethrower ammo as well. I love that I was like dead scared of this place at first, but now I'm just like walking around, not giving a giant shit at all. My, my companions are actually being quite useful now. I'm not here to kill you. I'm only here to kill the actual guards. And the guards is what? Well. I'm here for a weapon, technically. Do do do. Right. Up to do. Alright, anything in here? Here's the station. You've been following that series? Who could think? Sublight for life. Corporations never lifted a finger for me. Salvage is a family business. All right, I can still talk to people. Backs. That's good. You do wonder where could we have been on the groundbreaker for a couple too many episodes now. But I'm just doing all the side quests because. Back to my other questions. Ask. I have nothing to hide. Weapons. Weapons. No. Oh. Nah. Dead end. I love that these guys don't seem to mind me. So who's left that hates me? Here they come! Get them! Okay, this is just getting two. Wait, hang on a second. Where is it? How would you like to burn? How would you like to all burn? I, I told you, right? You can't beat a guy with a flamethrower. No matter how many people you send at me, you can't beat a guy with a flamethrower. It doesn't happen, okay? And that's the end of that. We probably want to purchase some more bullets, to be honest. Are we done? Are we done? There we are. But yeah, took his legs off. Oh, how do we get in there? I don't know how many people are left on Groundbreaker, to be honest.
Are we still fighting? I'm just too strong to deal with. Oh. You guys messed up. Like I said, you messed up. Right, are we done? Are we still not done here? Where's the flame? How am I, I going to get more flamethrower ammo? That's a worry, actually. I don't know how I'm going to get more flamethrower ammo. Oh, my God. Right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go back because, obviously, there won't be any people back. I don't kill. I don't kill any. I don't kill innocents. I thought just shit, just shitting them. I'm just going to go to the vending machine and see if I can get myself some more ammo. Okay, let's see. Sell junk. First of all, power energy based weapons. That sounds like. Flamethrowers. Heavy ammo is for machine guns, I'm assuming. No, that would be light ammo. Wait, I bought all this ammo, but nothing's happened in the ammo. Unless it starts adding when I start shooting. Let me just check. Is down on 22. I do. Oh, I've never had so much fun ever in my life. This is just hilariously funny. Oh, I got I gained more ammo. I see. So I have the cartridges only you start using them. Right, I just need to test something. Now that's good. That works. What's in here? Oh, this is the meds one. I can device. My money isn't the greatest. A lot yeah, of things are dead. But I don't care about the crew. The crew, right? The crew can do whatever the hell they want. That's fine by me. I'm just here for the weapon. But if anyone keeps shooting at me, I'm going to shoot them back. No? Still have a lot of enemies around. It's just a corpse of death. I mean, I mean, let's look at it. Corpse of death and destruction. Oh, this opens now. Like, seriously, how much have we killed now? There are still a few things to kill. I know that before. I know there are still some... Oh, there's an elevator here. Where's this take me? Where'd this go? This elevator takes you somewhere. Terra Monarch. King. Uh huh. This guy's crazy, even by my standard. Look Who's at this, this guy? ripe piece of meat just sizzling on the grill. <laughs> yum yum. Ah. Uh, Time to feed the. F uh, nothing personal. I'll just be going. I was just exploring the ship and stumbled on this level. You stumbled into my court without an invitation, neighbor from above. I mean, I'm gonna beat your ass you if you try. Business. 
and it's time to light up the grill. All right. No one turns their back on me while I'm holding court. Get them, boys. They got the drop on us. I don't think you guys realize who you're messing with. Never mind, this guy's strong. Okay, right. I got a better idea. Right, continue. I'm pretty sure this will take us back to there because it was an auto save. And here's what we're gonna do. A neighbor from above approaches our realm. Back away. Here we go. Well, that's gotta hurt. How many we killed so far? Okay, we're winning. Only two left. Dear. Who won? Who won the fight? Outlaw strike, man. These are all outlaws. So if I reload, will it? No, it's not. So how do I get my flamethrower on my back? I'm mean, not gonna lie. I'll take everything in here. I bet you the science weapons in here, you know. 100% better science for you know. Old Bess's outflow pipes. Ah, huh? we're, we're getting armor parts and stuff. Right. Like marauders. They, they used to be dead strong. I bet you now. If they fought in marauders, they get fucked. Oh, we could have a sleep. So, how do we get more. Flamethrower ammo. We're carrying too much again. What the hell? Is that a shrink ray? Hold my horses one second, please. It's a shrink ray. <laughs> right, let's just drop the axe. Break down. Ah, oh, you can break them down as weapon parts. That's what all this junk's good for. Oh, it's this guy. Right. This could get tricky. Right, mate. There we go. That's that dead. Oh yeah, so it keeps using the ammo. It keeps using the energy cell. Right, okay, I get it. I never actually run out of ammo. Oh. But where the fuck am I? But there's no weapon! No goddamn weapon. I'm not gonna lie, I'm finding some awesome shit though. <gasps> oh, second floor. Today's my birthday. Oh, yeah? Your birthday. Here we go! Ah! <laughs> I'll take that. <laughs> Just clearing them all out. Come on, it's the gut it's the weapon in here. You would think it would be, wouldn't you? I'm causing way too much havoc though, haven't I? 
Oh, we've got an A launcher. Sweet. <laughs> we just cleared them all out. Like, they were like, yo, what's up, dickhead? Let's kill them all. People don't like oh. Oh, they're just killing soil. I'd rather use light ammo here if I can. If I can. <laughs> All right, are we bringing in the big guns? There we are. I told you. Did I just pick it up? Um, too much again, but it's fine. And I've worked out what we do now. We dismantle shit that we don't need. Where the hell are we? Oh, more energy cells. I'm just hoping to see, you know. My flamethrower has more ammo now. I still don't find any weapons. More ammunition, though. Kind of nice. This has been such a fun episode. Oh, weapon parts. Ah, that's what it is. Weapon parts. You break it down into weapon parts to repair your shit. I get it. Any more information come up on that journal? Yeah, I'm, I am regretting killing Gladius now. But... It is what it... I don't think I searched everywhere. These last two episodes have just been going on killing sprees. Like, literally. That's what it's been. I don't know how many people I've killed, but I've probably killed just too many to count. But eventually I will find this thing because I'm searching everywhere. So it's eventually going to happen. You know what I mean? That's the thing. It will eventually happen. But yeah, it was a cool little area to find here. Let's carry on. We took out some uh, hostiles. Proper hostiles, by the way. Not just... I'm not using a hacker door for that. It's the doubt of it being there is quite low. Right, I bet you. Are there any board people still alive? No, nope, the board are dead as well, of course. Right, we never went through this door, so we're going through it. Well, that was a waste of seven fucking hackers. We never went. Did we? I bet you. What should be in the boardroom? I doubt it is, but you never know. No, because you pick up anything, don't you? It's Spacer's Choice. Look how deserted this place is now. <laughs> I'm lost. Where the hell would it be? This science thing. Where would it be? Let's see what he bloody says, the journal. Hang on, so much editing. Acquire the science weapon on Groundbreaker. The logs on Hawthorne's terminal mentioned rumors from the Groundbreaker scientist who bragged about a powerful weapon he was researching. Perhaps more details could be found on the station. Another Hawthorne log mentioned looking in Gladys' shop for old records. Apparently, the smuggler acquired several leads that way. Gladys, one Groundbreaker is dead. Unable to sell anything about So... I've been very violent on this game, and I've probably screwed the campaign over a little bit, but I do think I should be able to locate this bloody science weapon. Watch it be in here, of all bloody places. I'm just going to just search around. They did say the station, so... Hmm. Maybe this... No, nothing there. Hang on. There's a little hole here. Hang on a second. Let's have a look up here. I've looked everywhere so far. You've got to find it eventually, right? Okay. Oh. Somebody's trying to fix this up, but Hello. Looks like they ain't been here just come across a new life. area! Poor old sweetie. Right. Let's just go like this. Right, here we go! Slow it down! No! Light up! I'm killing my own.
Whoa, heavy machine gun. This looks like the place. I'm not gonna lie. This generally looks like where you would find the weapon. Is it in here? Hang on a minute. Is that it? Yes! Oh my god, it was there! After all that. Like, honestly. You, you couldn't write it if you tried. Uh, let's get rid of all the crap stuff. Too many hammers. I acquired the weapon. Hey, look, we've got ammo again for the flamer. Who would have thought this little section here would be where it was? You know, I honestly didn't think to look here at all. I probably only just saw that gap in the opening, and then I realised it was there. Bar this. Oh, and that opens that bit up as well. Oh my god, so there is... You can get in through there if you had like a proper hacking device or something, but... Yeah, that's pretty awesome. I'm glad we got that sorted anyway. Can I buy some hacking devices now? Because that would be awesome. Now, for some reason over here, I can't buy any hacking devices. But yeah, I'm I'm gonna uh, I'm in the mood to just oh yeah, give me that and that. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Uh, uh, sod it, bribe. All right, I'll look the other way this time. I, I'm just I'm tired of killing things. I just want some hacking devices. Before I leave, you know what I mean? Okay, right. We got what we came for. We found it. Who would have thought it would be there, though? Of all places. Crazy, right? I just saw that gap before. I'm going exploring. Found some secret location. There's the thing. Take the weapon. We got the weapon. So, with the side quest finished... Do I get to use this said so-called weapon? Hail, Captain. Your return time. I want to equip it, man. The plasma hammer. Let's put it on for the plasma. Hang on a second. We gotta do something. We we, we have to. We we just have to. I'm sorry. <laughs> I have a problem. I have I have a little problem when it comes to open world games. I have to do things so differently. <laughs> this game is so good. I'm so glad I played it. I'm so glad that I got recommended it. It is so good. Hey, dude! Hammer time! Hammer time! <laughs> Right, we're going. <laughs> Hammer time! <laughs> Against all odds. Captain. Right. Where are we off? Monarch. Wait, what, what mission are we doing? Search for clues on Monarch. Oh, are we heading over? All right, well, before we go, let's just do a bit of repairing. Because you know we can repair pretty much every good weapon. Uh, for example, heavy machine gun. Hammer time! Grenade launcher. Shot cannon. Finally be sorted out. We really are have we really have the weapons now to deal with what we want to deal with. Fly away to glorious victory. Message from Dr. Wells. He'd like to congratulate you on finding a route to Monarch. Play one screen. Cascadia? I don't know if you're extraordinarily brave or slightly suicidal, but Cascadia is one of the most dangerous places in Monarch. Please be careful out there. You'll need to speak with Hiram Blythe. He's known as the information broker, and for good reason. If anyone knows where I can find those chemicals, it's Hiram. I need those chemicals to revive the Hope's colonists. They can help us fight back against the board. They can help us set things right. The board's dead. 
If we don't put a stop to the board, they're going to drive this colony toward a complete societal collapse. You'll see what I mean when you arrive on Monarch. Oh, is there more board? Just have it today. You'll want to hire the services of a skilled guide. I recommend a hunter by the name of Neoka. Frequents the drinking establishments of Stellar Bay. Very hard to miss. Once you have everything you need, make your way to Hiram Blythe's compound. Okay, right, I'm off. Best of luck, everyone on the Hope. Captain, an unusual wavelength is coming through Monarch's Aether Wave frequencies. The Eternal is in us all. The OSI would have you believe that your place in society, indeed in the universe, is preordained. A man who works in the mines of Hephaestus, coating his lungs in mercury dust for not but a few bits a night. This fate is set in stone? When he dies young, coughing up black blood, his part in the grand plan? No, I say. Greatness is in everyone. Not just those so fortunate as to have been born into prosperity. That was unexpected. Yeah. And odd. Yeah. Uh, see, so Dutra liked him or sounded like a bunch of nonsense. I'm inclined to agree with your assessment, by which I mean. Right. Uh, okay. Wow. Well, 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 well. Things are just too fun at the moment. Wouldn't you agree? All right. Thank you, guys. Well, everyone, that is going to conclude this episode of Outer Worlds. We are just. We're just, we're just, I'm having too much fun. I really am. The game is just far too fun. And I'm really just enjoying all the sneaky things you can do. Attacking people that you wouldn't normally attack in a game. It just seems to make the game a lot more fun. And I love that killing main quest characters gives you like a shortcut or gives you a thing that makes it harder. For example, if I didn't kill Gladys, I would have found that weapon so much sooner. I kind of got lucky when suddenly I looked and there was a hole in the room and I saw it and I was like, right, it's got to be there. All right, thanks to you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, remember to give a like, rate, make sure to subscribe, comment your thoughts on this episode because Outer Worlds is going nowhere. I don't know how long this game is, but I really am enjoying it and I hope you guys are too. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.